The cloud is front and center in a lot of technology discussions these days, and everybody wants to know how they can take advantage of it. Here's an idea for people managing data storage. Use it to solve some of your biggest storage problems, like data growth and capacity management, backup, archiving, and disaster recovery protection. How, you may ask? By integrating cloud storage services with local storage. Let me explain. First, we need to think about what cloud storage is good for and what it's not. It's great at being elastic and incrementally adding resources. It's the pay-as-you-grow scalability model. It's also good at being resilient because there's a lot of redundancy built into cloud storage services. Okay, so what's cloud not good at? Cloud storage has a relatively high latency and poor throughput compared to traditional storage. So it's good for moderate amounts of work and storing data reliably, but it's not so good at doing a lot of work in a hurry. In other words, cloud storage is much better suited to Tier 2 applications that include things like Exchange, SharePoint, and VMware environments than it is for Tier 1 applications like transaction processing. But here's the thing. Most companies have a lot more Tier 2 data with moderate performance requirements than they have Tier 1 data with heavy-duty performance requirements. Still, the question is, can cloud storage get the job done? So let's take a look at Tier 2 data and its performance requirements. One of the first things you notice is that a large percentage of Tier 2 data is consuming capacity but isn't being used. In other words, it's inactive or cold. When we think about data growth and its associated capacity problems, we tend to focus on the incoming data that's being created, but the real problem is all the old cold data that keeps accumulating. Incoming data, and the data that's active in the system, is called the working set. The working set is constantly evolving as new data is added to it and as older data becomes inactive. If you break the problem down to storing these two types of data, the working set and cold data, you can imagine a solution that integrates sand storage with cloud storage, putting the working set on the sand part and the cold data on the cloud part. It's the best of both worlds. Store Simple calls this type of storage system cloud integrated storage. Cloud integrated storage from Store Simple has the same technologies as any other leading enterprise SAN storage system. It has SSDs, SAS drives, automated tiering, deduplication, compression, thin provisioning, application consistent snapshots for apps like Exchange, SQL Server, and SharePoint, and certified support from VMware. It's a dual controller architecture, and all components can be hot swapped, and it features non disruptive software upgrades. It's a fully featured enterprise iSCSI SAN storage system with the big difference being its ability to use cloud storage as a tier. But when you think about it, using cloud as a tier for cold data takes care of another problem at the same time, archiving. Data that needs archiving can easily be archived to cloud storage where it is accessible by information workers that might need it again. Busy storage administrators don't need to even get involved. And as long as we're talking about archiving, what about backup? Store Simple Cloud Integrated Storage has snapshots, called Cloud Snaps, for point in time data recovery and synthetic backups for DR, called Cloud Clones. As the name implies, both are stored in the cloud, encrypted with AES 256 technology. So, what about DR? Cloud storage is made for it. And there's a real important detail we'll get to in a minute. But first, let's talk about location. Disaster recovery with the cloud can be done anywhere. It's location independent because you can access DR data in the cloud from any site with an internet connection and a store simple cloud integrated storage system. Customers don't have to spend money on a recovery facility because cloud storage is the recovery facility and there's no need to provision special networks for replication because a cloud connection is all you need. Now about that important detail I mentioned. The problem with a full recovery from the cloud is the network performance of cloud storage. If you use cloud storage as a virtual tape device, it will probably take you a lot longer than you thought to download the virtual tapes. If you're thinking it could take days, you might need to check that again. It could take weeks. Store Simple has a cloud restore technology called Thin Restores. The idea is simple. Leave the cold data in the cloud and only restore the data you need. In other words, the working set. This is a huge time saver when you really want to save time. With Store Simple Cloud Integrated Storage, cloud storage is a tier, which means data is not downloaded and then restored. It is simply accessed and added to the working set of your storage system. RTOs, or recovery time objectives, are amazingly short. 
So it turns out that cloud storage can solve a lot of the big problems in enterprise storage if it's integrated with local SAN storage and used as a tier and a repository for backup, archive, and DR. Just like everything else the cloud touches, storage is never going to be the same again. Thanks for watching.